Right, let's talk about Luis Suarez, shall we? He's been linked to a move back to Liverpool if Mohamed Salah were to leave. Um, how do you think Liverpool fans would take that news? Because they'll be getting rid of well, one of their greats and getting back someone well, who's he's a legend. He? They do love him, so I don't, I don't think there's any doubt about that. And I don't think... I think he'd like to come back. I don't think there's any doubt about that. Uh, but he wouldn't be a main player, would he? So, But they still need to replace Salah. And Suarez replacing Salah is not going to give them anything no. having him as well as someone else if he's going to be in the squad and he's better than Origi to come off the bench so be it because at the minute let's be honest Firmino's not scoring the goals you would like he's mm -hmm. not playing as well mm -hmm. as Liverpool would like he doesn't add goals as many as Liverpool would like Origi doesn't give you anything either off the bench Jota has given something extra um, he's become a regular but if they're going to get rid of Salah and sell him, or Salah wants to leave more like, and go to someone else, a fresh Like a big club. Start. Yeah, well, a fresh start. <laughs> Let's be honest, a fresh mm. start. They have to get a massive player to replace him. They can't just not. They can't but just even, get Suarez and say he's going to replace Even Salah. Luis Suarez coming in, I saw him when Chelsea played uh, at Letty. I thought he was, I mean, he got subbed. He was so slow. He was nothing like the... Well, they all were, though. They were rubbish, yeah. a lot of them in that but game. But why would, why would Liverpool want Suarez back? I don't think Liverpool fans would want him back. Do you? Well, if he's off the bench, it's not a bad thing. Look, is look at Gareth Bale. Play the odd game. Of course, happened to Bale at Spurs. Would he do any worse than what some of the Liverpool players in that position have done this season? Would he? Would, you made a good point. Would he be better coming off the bench than um, Origi? Origi, hundred percent, or, or even Shakiri? Hundred percent. Yeah, I think so. One hundred percent. So I get him if he wants to come to Liverpool. They want to get him for a year or two years, uh, similar to that Manchester United did with Ibrahimovic, who has gone on and actually and played a lot longer since he left Manchester United. Mm. And everybody thought it were done. Uh, we've seen uh, Ronaldo. What is Ronaldo now? Thirty-seven. Yeah. You're talking about him coming back to Manchester United. You talked about it yesterday. They've had Cavani. Um, so I get it. I, I get it if he comes to add to their squad and it's someone better than Origi coming off the bench. They still need to replace Salah. Do you want to? Do you want to see him back in the Premier League, Suarez? Are you not fast? Not fast. No, not me. Absolutely not fast. Who, who's at all. a bigger legend in the eyes of Liverpool fans? I don't know. You're going to say that Salah has won the league Salah. and the Champions League. Salah, mate. Salah's a bigger I, legend than I, Luis Suarez. I would, I, he has to be. Look how quick he got to 50 goals. Mm. His record is out of this world. People say he's having an absolute howler this year. What has he got? 17 goals in the Premier League. Mm. I, th I, find, I find that I know I'm going to get absolutely slaughtered for this but I'd like to hear from football fans not Liverpool fans because of course they think that Muhammad Ali is the greatest player ever to wear the Liverpool shirt or one of which I get which Muhammad I understand. Ali did you say there? Muhammad Salah I'm sure, I'm sure he said Muhammad said, Ali I Muhammad Ali I didn't say Muhammad Ali he said, he said Muhammad, Muhammad Ali, Ali really didn't he? Muhammad Ali. <laughs> that just goes to prove I have no idea what's coming out with he that. actually said something the other day I didn't pick him up on it what did he say the other day? he said Axel Foley off um, yeah I did that on purpose did you? Yeah, off uh, Beverly Hills Cup. Oh, he did, did that on purpose. purpose. Yeah. I nearly picked him but up. But I didn't do that. Muhammad Ali on purpose. I really said Muhammad Ali? Yeah. Wow. Check back. Check him out. But he's good. And if I did, I, don't, I don't play. Don't but play. It's funny. But Liverpool <laughs> fans think... I'll tell you what, that's probably why, because subconsciously I'm thinking of the greatest ever, and then I, I'm the questioning greatest. whether or not Muhammad Salah, right, is in that bracket, right? Because I know all Liverpool fans adore him. I get that. And you mentioned how great his numbers are. And his, his numbers are unbelievable. They are fantastic, right? But, right, but I'd like to hear from football fans of other clubs other than Liverpool if they still agree with how great a player Salah is. Because I think he's a very, very good player. Is he world class, Mohamed Salah? Is he yeah. world class? Is yeah. he world class? Yeah. It, but I know this is going to sound crazy, right? He's only got one trick, hasn't he? Put it onto his left foot and then put the ball in. in the back of the net. Yeah. But he can only do it one way. He's quite greedy. It's not a great. It's not not a great trick. That he doesn't it? turn up in big games. <laughs> Scott, he's got only twenty odd goals a season. No, but I'm, just, I'm just asking. Is he as great as? I mean, like, there are other players on the planet that I rate as world class that I think are better than him. But that's who they need to sign Liverpool. Surely, again, they've been brilliant for a few seasons. Manchester City this year have been brilliant. Liverpool so now a, have to get back on. If they're going to lose a high quality player like Salah, yeah, they've got to get. Sancho's, I don't know if he'd be as good as Salah, but he's someone who could play for a long time for Liverpool. And Mbappe is the obvious one, but is he's he going to go to Liverpool? He's, he's been linked there before, no, though. He won't go there. But OK, so world-class players, Kevin De Bruyne, I put in that category. Yep. Right? For me, it's a no-brainer. Kevin De Bruyne is much better than Mohamed Salah. Would you not agree with that? Yeah, they're slightly different, though, what they do. Yeah, I know Kevin they are. Kevin De Bruyne doesn't score 24 goals a season. I know he doesn't. I know he doesn't. You've got to start comparing him to Greenwood. 
or no, that's a bit unfair. Well, it's not. Greenwood or well, Rashford a young or, kid or James. Uh, no, that's, well, no, you can't compare him. They're to... all playing for Manchester United in those positions. Yes, but you're saying I'm comparing him to other world class players. You're just comparing him to players. But Manchester United, the fourth richest club in the world. Why are you talking about United? You, so what you've got in those positions? Do you need someone world class? Why? I don't know why you bought Man United. Up. I'm just asking the question because you're bringing Liverpool. Or I'm just saying what a lot of fans out there will be saying. So hang on a minute. He's saying Salah's not world class. No, I'm not. I'm not Manchester saying that. United in those positions. Would you call Rashford world class? Why I don't understand why you brought Rashford into it. I'm just How asking, have you done that? I'm just asking. How have you done that? <laughs> just to try and put you on the spot. <laughs> Would I say Rashford's world class? He's on his way to being world class. Yeah, he's in the right direction, without a doubt. So is Mohamed Salah on the way to being world class, or he's just not world class? He's on, he's on the way to being it. Same as Rashford. You've well, lost, no, he's, he's lost the plot. He, he's 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 he's, he's okay. finally All lost right. it. All right. Is Messi world class? <laughs> yeah. Right. So you're putting Salah and Messi on the same level. Um, not on the same level, but he's... Well, why am I putting mine on the same level? When you're going for you're... Ballon d'Or yeah. and you picking players to be in it, yeah. Salah would be nominated. Yeah, but that doesn't year mean after year. That doesn't mean anything. Well, of course it means something. No, it doesn't. Yeah, what's, it means he, yeah what's his name win it at, at uh, Real Madrid recently? He was an ex-Spurs player with the... What was his name? Modric. Mod- Luka Modric won it recently. I mean, he wasn't the best player on the planet when he won it, was he? Oh, he was. He was outstanding. Look what Real Madrid you know, did that was season. But Luka Modric's not the best player on the planet, is he? He's he never... was that season. He wasn't. He wasn't. He was. Lewandowski, world-class player. Mohamed Salah. He's never won it. Well, he, he should have won, won it last when it was cancelled, yeah. 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 And he should win it this year. All right. Well, I, I, I'd like to hear. I reckon there are other football fans out there that agree with me about Mohamed Salah. They're not sold on him being world-class. Great player. <clears throat> One trick pony.